I was cleaning this Briggs and Stratton carburetor. And I made the mistake of getting carburetor cleaner on the float bowl gasket and that caused the gasket to expand. It used to fit down on the inside lip of the float bowl and you can see how much it expanded right there on the left. See how much it's sticking out. So I need to get this to retract back to its normal size. I need the, I need the solvent that apparently the rubber absorbed which caused it to expand. I need to get that solvent out of the rubber. One suggestion that I read online which is what I'm going to try is to boil the gasket for about 10 minutes and then put it in the oven under a low temperature also for about 10 minutes. Let's see if just boiling it shrunk it. And if it didn't, then I'll put it in the oven. And the answer to that is no. Just boiling it did not shrink it. So let me cut the oven on, put it in there for about 10 minutes. I'll try it at 200 degrees. For 10 minutes. It smells like gasoline as soon as I open the door. So maybe some of the solvent dissipated out of the gasket. I kind of doubt it, but we'll see. 10 minutes in the oven at 200 did not shrink the gasket. So it's back in the oven for 10 more minutes, this time at 350. And also every couple of minutes, I'm flipping the gasket to try to keep it from sticking to the pan. That is 10 minutes at 350. very hot understandably question is is it smaller and yes it is look at that let me get back outside put the camera on the tripod because I think using two hands I'll be able to push that down into position all right now with two hands on it yeah that's in that's all the way around let me find a clip of how it was before and now after the combination of 10 minutes of boiling water, 10 minutes in the oven, I would say at 350, use the 350 and flip it every couple of minutes. That shrunk this carb bowl gasket and I can use it again. Never would have believed it, but it worked. Hope this helps. Thanks for watching.